Welcome to another edition of Driving Perilously. Talking to no one. I'm talking to everyone. Um, today I'm going to continue my series of turning on the radio and talking about a second of what I hear. Or what I hear for a second. Schlei bells and schnitzel with noodles. Schlei, schlei. bells and schnitzel with noodles. These are a few of my favorite things. Um, very interesting topic for me. Someone who's very interested in musicals and someone who's very interested in Christmas music. Why in the heck my favorite things from The Sound of Music is considered a Christmas song? I have no idea. Yes, it mentions brown paper packages tied up with string. Have you ever had a brown paper package tied up with string underneath your Christmas tree? No. So that's not a Christmas present. That's something that's been shipped, which might be a present. Who knows what it is? It's not Christmas. My favorite things is not Christmas. Of course, one of people's favorite things that's pretty common is Christmas. A lot of people's favorite thing is Christmas. But in The Sound of Music, do they sing that song at Christmas time? I don't think so. I don't know. But the Supremes do a version of my favorite things on their Christmas album. Sandy Patty does a version of my favorite things on her Christmas album. But that particular Christmas album is a masterpiece. It's like watching a master sing with a full symphony orchestra with a whole evening of a wonderful program. And it just happens to include my favorite things. So I, she can she can intertwine that with Tchaikovsky, uh, Nutcracker and all kinds of other Christmas things and that's fine with me but my favorite things has nothing to do with Christmas um, Mary J. Blige put it on her Christmas album are you kidding me another underrated Christmas album if you don't like Mary J. Blige it's because you haven't listened to enough Mary J. Blige go ahead and check out her Christmas album it's awesome just Listen to my favorite things when it's not Christmas time because it has nothing to do with Christmas. So, my favorite things is from The Sound of Music, which is Rodgers and Hammerstein's masterwork, or one of their masterworks. Um, lots of good stories from that film, lots of good tie ins with uh, historical events lots of good tie-ins with all kinds of issues and big differences between the play version and the stage <coughs> the play stage version and the movie version <coughs> so that's my talking while I'm driving perilously after <coughs> having turned on the radio for a couple seconds and heard what was going on uh, I don't know who that singer was I was almost definitely on 100.3 Legends because it was an unfamiliar singer doing my favorite things as a Christmas song. He sounded good. He must have been a singer from the 50s or 60s because um, he knew how to sing. So have a great day and Merry Christmas to you and yours from 1 to 92 and you.